As three I Atlas drifts steadily closer to Earth, something unusual has begun happening behind the scenes. Global monitoring agencies, including UN-affiliated planetary defense networks, European space surveillance groups, North American deep sky trackers, and several private observatories have quietly intensified their observation drills, not because the object is dangerous, not because there's an impact threat, but because this interstellar visitor has begun behaving in ways no one expected and no one wants to ignore. For months, its motion was simple, smooth, mathematically perfect, a silent blur sliding through the blackness with the predictable calm of a cold interstellar wanderer. But recently, the data has stopped behaving, the light curves are shifting, the imagery is evolving, and the sudden quiet from certain agencies has made scientists wonder what exactly appeared in the latest high-resolution frames. So the question becomes unavoidable. What changed? And what are these new images actually showing? At this moment, 3i Atlas is hovering somewhere between 260 and 280 million kilometers from Earth, a wide range depending on the observational model, but close enough for the world's most advanced telescopes to finally break through the blur and capture meaningful detail. Early in the year, the object was barely more than a foggy smudge, a dim cloud, a stable, unremarkable brightness curve with no spikes or dips. But the newest ultra-processed frames, they tell a story no one expected. The core no longer looks stable. The brightness doesn't fade smoothly, it pulses. The entire structure appears to be tightening as if the mass is compressing inward and in several frames, a faint circular ring of light wraps around the central object, almost like a shock halo forming under conditions we don't understand. This isn't normal comet behavior, this isn't typical solar heating, and it's not a fragmentation event. If anything, it appears to be the exact opposite of a breakup. The nucleus looks darker and more compact, almost as if it is becoming denser, while the coma surrounding it is expanding and brightening. New patterns are emerging in the outer shell, streaks, arcs, fine layers that weren't visible even a week earlier. The contrast between the shadowed core and the glowing outer region has grown so dramatically that several astronomers describe the object as a fading lantern wrapped in a halo that sharpens with every frame. Another researcher admitted that the thermal response doesn't match any model of how interstellar ices should behave under sunlight. Normally, the core should brighten first as heat penetrates the surface, but 3i Atlas is doing the opposite. The core is fading, the halo is sharpening, and the newly visible arcs behave like structured, repeating reactions, not random dust. And here's where things get even more intriguing. This year's global planetary defense drills, annual simulations designed to test tracking systems, early warning networks, and communication pathways, just happened to overlap perfectly with the timing of 3i Atlas's approach. Coincidence or not, the alignment is almost too precise. These drills include tracking irregular fast-moving deep space bodies, modeling non-linear or unpredictable trajectories, testing real-time data-sharing infrastructure between nations, rehearsing rapid observational response plans, not because anyone expects danger, but because every real interstellar visitor, especially one acting unpredictably, is the perfect real-world test subject. Several observatories have now officially placed 3i Atlas on their priority watch list. This doesn't indicate fear. It signals opportunity. Anytime a foreign object from another star system passes close to Earth, scientists have a chance to gather data that may not repeat for centuries. Earth isn't afraid. Earth is paying attention. And the closer 3i Atlas comes, the stranger the images become. In the latest ultra-processed frames, astronomers noticed something faint but persistent, an emerging forward-facing glow, almost like a controlled plume or a soft jet, coming from one side of the object. It's too stable to be a normal comet tail. It sits slightly off-axis, and it does not behave like dust being blown away by sunlight. Some astronomers cautiously call it a jet, Others say it may be a shadow illusion caused by uneven surface geometry. A few suggest chemical reactions unlike anything seen in solar system bodies, but the most important detail is this. It wasn't there before, and now it appears consistently. Additionally, multiple frames reveal a sharpened, crescent-shaped arc of brightness along the perimeter. 
something like a pressure ridge glowing in sunlight. The object seems to respond to solar radiation in slow, rhythmic pulses, as though sun exposure triggers delayed chemical reactions deep within its surface layers. These reactions do not follow the rules of comets formed in our solar system, and that opens the door to a deeper possibility. Some researchers now believe we are witnessing chemistry from a completely different star system activating for the first time in millions, possibly billions, of years. Cold interstellar ices cracking open, alien minerals releasing trapped gases, dust layers shedding into structured shells, all unfolding in slow motion. This is behavior born under a different sun, different temperatures, different pressures, different physics. And as Earth continues through its orbit, 3i Atlas edges toward the point where observatories worldwide will capture their clearest images yet. In the coming weeks, its brightness may spike dramatically, revealing the true structure of the nucleus, the nature of the plume-like glow, the geometry of the arcs, and potentially even the mineral signatures buried beneath its dust. And this is where the story shifts from curiosity to revelation. Every new image, every pulse of brightness, every unexplained pattern, every unexpected chemical signature. All of it is telling us a story, a story about where this traveler was born, what it survived, and what conditions shaped its journey across interstellar space. 3i Atlas isn't dangerous, it isn't heading toward Earth, but it has become one of the most scientifically unpredictable and fascinating phenomena of the year. And the world is watching, not with fear, but with pure anticipation, because as it approaches, the object continues to transform in real time, brightening, darkening, sharpening, evolving, revealing secrets buried for eons. This close passage isn't about threat, it's about discovery, about witnessing something no generation before us has seen, and something no future generation may ever see again. An ancient traveler, awakening under sunlight, changing before our eyes, carrying the signature of a world we may never find. And Earth, our small blue world in the dark, is about to witness its closest, clearest moment.